Early access build 24 is here in Ravenfield. This is a pretty big update and it's been a little bit of time actually since the last one. So I'm pretty excited. But the thing that they've upgraded apparently on this amazing looking aircraft carrier, there's still some things that I'd love for to be functional, but like the planes got like shiny new models. It looks like, I don't know, maybe the propellers are bigger. I mean, they definitely look crisper, don't you think? But apparently you can land these things back on the aircraft carrier, right? Okay, so let's see. We're gonna be coming from that side to land on it. So I think what we need to do actually, and look at look how slow I can go with this. I can almost turn to like a break. We're gonna drop the plane off right here. You stay there. Stop. Okay, good. I want to clear the runway so that my landing is going to be a little bit easier. But we can land on the aircraft carrier now. So what we need to do is hop in this other one. Oh, isn't she beautiful? Look at all of those rockets. We got little gas canisters for like more fuel. You got your twin machine guns on either side. I guess this would be what, a turbo jet or something? Look at that. We've got a new HUD heads up display right here. Yeah, this thing definitely looks like pretty different in terms of like, you know, the elevators and kind of like the rear wing area for lack of better words. But the elevators, the rudder and the ailerons are all bright and shiny blue to kind of give you a good indication of who's on what side. But generally speaking, what we're going to have to do is line up properly. And apparently the handling is better too. And then as we start coming in, we need to slow down so that ideally, oh, Oh, something just exploded. Oh no, the other plane. That means it's gonna respawn, okay. Also, if you look, we have like double the bomb payload now. We've got 16 rockets as opposed to eight, I think is what the old amount was. I feel like that's the slowest I can go. Oh God, and there's another plane here. Ooh. Oh, landing gear's down. We touched it. Okay. Oh, we're gonna have to speed up. Okay. Third time's the charm. And then after this, we're gonna show off the new map and all of its updates, which is definitely gonna be favoring the new kind of aircraft, depending on which team you are. Cause one team gets the defending aircraft and one team has to fight the defending aircraft. It's funny, man. This reminds me of that old game War Thunder and like trying to land on the carriers in that game. That was hard, at least for me. <laughs> all right, throttling down. So the lowest speed I think we can go is 60. Now I don't think this is how you'd actually want to do it, but you know, this is how we're doing it. All right, can we come to a stop before the end of the runway, please? Oh, we pulled it off. That is awesome. Now, if we hop out now, I think what we need to do is then if aircraft could be upgraded to where or updated, <laughs> updated, upgraded, both I think works. And it's called a buzzard, eh? Now the bomber apparently can do the same thing, but now it's time to check out the new level. So it's apparently an entire new revamping and maybe even re mapping of Citadel. So we're gonna get everybody back in this and we're gonna put, oh, I say a hundred bots. So this is a quote from Steel Raven. Pretty much everything in the level has been updated. So I'm thinking we actually start as Raven to see the Citadel fortress itself. This is effectively a giant fortress siege. And I actually want to try out the new aircraft. So I feel like right there would be the best place to deploy. So Blue's going to be storming and trying to eventually take all of these objective points, right? I feel like they should, uh, uh, it'd be cool to have a mode where like the AI, where's, okay. Oh, wow. There's, oh, those planes down here are just for Luck, uh, looks and look at that. We've got some like elevators going on. You better not steal my plane or I will pistol whip you son Whoa, you guys are fast. I said That's my plane Billy Billy get away from the plane All right, your name's croc our brand new. Oh, man I feel like it looks better in red actually. We got our new HUD and this allows us to what our new bombs Oh god, where's the missile? Oh, there it is incoming missile throttle up or what we could do as the missile closes in drop flares what the did we drop them in time oh my goodness look at that thing okay we did it just in time i've actually never flown outside the map that's what it looks like <laughs> all right so i want to go ground attack with my 16 rockets and it looks like oh he just dropped smoke now that's pretty smart if he's like oh gosh enemy aircraft i'm gonna drop smoke but then he left it so let's see Got a little bit of drop on these things. And he's hiding behind these trees, which means, oh, 
Hey guys, please don't shoot me. I am your friend. I may have just been trying to attack you. Oh, uh, there goes my ankles. Oh yeah, I pooped out some jelly there. You know that's when it gets bad when you're pooping out jelly. Okay. Don't worry. Ambush. <laughs> Suckers. This is what you call the best defense is a strong offense. I saw a shadow. Is it a paratrooper? Oh god. I thought that said Markiplier for a second. It was just Intruder. All right, we killed a pizza. Ow, I'm bleeding out jelly. Oh man, we got a little sniper with the DMR sneaking over there. Okay, so let's see, where else would we want to defend? Probably this first bunker complex. This bunker complex is actually one of my favorite parts on the entire map. It just makes me think about like, oh God, look at all those tracers coming in from way over there. Like, you're defending D-Day, right? And look at this thing, man. This bunker is glorious. All right. Yeah, and look at this, man. Just fully stocked with inventory. But it's funny. We got three windows, and everybody loves the left window. Hey, thanks for the ammunition. And nobody's on the machine gun. I'm pretty sure one of these, the last time we showed off, like, the updates to this, I got on this machine gun and just destroyed everybody. Ah! Oh! Got it! Okay. Let's try out the other bunker complex. Now, we're going to be playing as both sides to kind of see the difference. Oh, God. This is a bad idea. We disabled the rhino, though. All right, reload this. We destroyed it. Disabled, then destroyed. Oh, I love all these boxes. A lot more cover going on. The anti-aircraft gun is a little bit protected. But you can't really reach these guys. Ow. Where? What shot me? I need a medic! But I, I love this map, because, like, look at that, man. Look at the citadel over there. It's Air Force flying overhead. The enemy team has helicopter support. And this bunker is really sweet. This one looks much, much cooler. Like, you got your little staging ground, and then when the blue boys are coming. I need the RK-44, which is, like, the upgraded one. Oh, we lost our machine gun. Got snipers trying to snipe at us. There we go. But I, I do believe we're being flanked by that Jeep. So we gotta get our anti-vehicle out. Ooh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, there it is. Hey, hey, boys! Oh, I'm sorry. I took out Predator and a Swammer. Is that the past tense of, uh, past tense of a swimmer? I w I'm no longer a swimmer. I am now only a swammer. I refuse to get in the water ever again. Now, this would be kind of cool if you get- Well, there are, like, little stairs and there's some sandbags up here. Oh, God! Oh, I was hit by the helicopter, but we saw some infantry peeking over. So, now the question is, what we have to do is, since red is- We need a little bit less- A little bit less of red. But I feel like what we need is a mode that's, like, siege mode. You know? That'd be cool. And I can give- oh, man. I can give my team orders like- I mean, this seems pretty obvious, right? Actually, let's go to battle plan. Go here. We'll attack there. Now, do I want to take the Zodiac and do like some amphibious landing? Or do I want to- I want to assault the main bunker. So I want to deploy over here and if I can, take the battle tank. Who wants to be my gunner? I gotta say, the Ravenfield models look so dang good. The infantry and the vehicles now are also looking amazing. Like, remember what the old vehicles look like? They were just like blocks with wheels, effectively. The helicopter is still looking the same, and I'm wondering when the attack helicopter specifically is gonna get its update. Here's the enemy planes. Let's go ahead and try to do the shot of all shots we missed. Wow. <laughs> what if I hit the one behind it? That would've been hilarious. I need like a little tow missile on this thing. Oh man, I love having a gunner. Okay, let's try to fire right inside that bunker complex. Take out that machine gun. Ow. What the biscuits just happened? I'm getting rocked. I'm getting rocked by... Is it... Oh! oh whoa! That's new! Yeah, so they have a tower with an anti-tank missile on it. That's brand new. I didn't even think to look there. What if there's any Easter eggs, man? I miss the Easter eggs. Easter eggs, secret weapons. All right, we got the attack helicopter. Yeah, this is definitely still the old model. It's held up all of these years. Oh my God. It's literally been years. Oh God. Ow. Jeez, I'm already dead. Ah, uh, we're going down here. Yeah, we're going down. Oh, look at that. Is that not karma? It said he was in any aircraft gun, but then I saw him, like, in a window. All right, one of you unlucky sons of a gun, or son of a biscuit. Which would you rather be, a son of a gun or a biscuit? Honestly, biscuits are delicious, but guns have a little bit more durability. My god, there's just no way to fly. Oh my god, there's an anti-aircraft gun, too. Airstrike requested! I'm trying to take out that gun. It doesn't look like I did it very well. Here's the base. All right, let's look at this base from above. Oh, hello, <laughs> attack aircraft. Oh my gosh, we're so gonna die. Oh, we're dead. 
All right, we'll pop the chute and see this from above. Definitely a lot more going on inside of the base. Oh my God, they've got this like prep area behind it. Is that new? This reminds me of Battlefield 1's like, uh, you know that big fortress map? That fortress map was so cool. I always wish there was actually like a proper siege mode for that map. Can't tell, I really love me some siege modes. And that's actually a question I wanted to ask for you today. Like, would you like to see a Ravenfield kind of like siege fortress defense mode? Or do you love it as it is? Like, you know, I mean, obviously it wouldn't replace it at all, but all right, can I jump here and then like do a little parachute? Parachute, parachute never drop. Yeah, these big old marble slabs. We got some industrial piping. Got a lot of wyverns kind of on deck, ready to go up. Now the question is, can I get up in this command center? Hey, you're supposed to be guarding this. You did not do a good job. All right, I can't kick through the door. Whoa, there's like a little ramp here. Oh man, this is brand new. And what's cool about this is I'm not supposed to be here. I'm the blue guy. Oh. All right, I'm infiltrating the base. That looks like it goes somewhere cool, but I want to see what's at the top of this. Oh, oh, this is like, oh my God. This is their headquarters. This is awesome. Hey everybody, someone come up here and arrest me. I'm not supposed to be here. That's kind of, uh, why was the guy guarding it right here? That seems like the worst place. Hey, <laughs> I'm Rambo. There we go. Look at those guys over there like, hey, I think there's a dude in my base, Kobe. All right, this is awesome, man. They're dropping smoke grenades all over the place, which is dumb. They should be trying to flush me out. Maybe, oh, you know what it is? In a future update, I would imagine they're gonna put a door here and they're gonna be able to climb up to the uh, airport command center. Oh, wow, we're storming this base right now, boys. Look at that, we're about to take the airfield. Reinforcements have arrived. Ha, ha, that was left-handed. What video game is that from? Ow. Uh-oh, they got some shotgunner boys. They finally flushed me out of the base. Okay, let's see. What does it look like? Oh, wow. We have stormed this freaking base. Now I want to see if they've updated anything around the waterfront. Oh, you better not take my boat. Dang it. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, you sons of guns, man. Don't my boat. Oh, you know what? Look at the map. They've definitely updated the waterfront. Okay. I mean, there's two kinds of boats. There's boats without wheels and there's boats with wheels. And we're going to take... We're gonna take one of the ones with wheels. We're gonna do a little amphibious landing. Oh man, I love that little machine gun on the side. Then I got my auto cannon. That thing is pretty cool looking. Yeah, but effectively what we're gonna do is just shimmy on down here and surprise the enemy. I, I said surprise. Don't just shoot off into the distance like it's something to do. There's nobody up there. Oh wow, they got, they got fortified defenses up there. There we go. A little suppressing fire. All right, there's a big bridge. Adding bunkers for the defending team, the defenders now have access to airplanes via the takeoff platform. The level is quite different from most official maps as you get quite a different experience playing as the attacking or defending team. Yeah, now we just need a formalized attack and defense mode. There's that tower that they had like the heavy uh, missiles on. We have not taken it. Our guys just seem to be skirting around it. This kind of reminds me of that scene like in Lord of the Rings when they're, uh, is it the Falls of Gondolin or something like that? You know when they're on their little elf boats? right before they get the, to the waterfall and they see those two big statues. Uh-oh, we do not want an airstrike to happen on us. Oh, check this out, okay. Dang, look at that, Red's already up there. I saw a guy with an, a heavy weapon. Oh, that guy's about to fall down. Dude, this map is definitely one of the best ones. I still think Archipelago is my favorite, but this is a close second. Did that, oh, direct hit. It's like you're on a lake in Switzerland or something. Uh-oh, don't hit me with that. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Here we go, we'll pop smoke. Then we can storm this. This is like where you're supposed to have the canoes and stuff to let the campers out go. You know, like, hey, enjoy the river. That'll be $800 a night. Send your kid to camp. Uh-oh, plane's trying to go airstrike on us. Yeah, so we've managed to get up this way. This is definitely like Swiss style, don't you think? Now, where do I go from here? Follow the yellow brick road. Okay, we got a fork in the road. Oh, we got a flag point. Uh-oh. Ow! Ow! Everybody out, everybody out. We gotta take this flag. Dang, Shadow. We got ambushed. All right, boys. Let's do this. All right, so what we got? Let's regroup. Regroup on me, boys. Ooh! Did he get him? No, he dropped flares. Oh, these sandbags, they could be. Wait, is that red? That looks like a little bit of red. Is it blood or is it a guy? But as we're storming this Swiss town, you know, they always said Switzerland was neutral, huh? All right, reload. Boys, take the take the point so I don't die. Dude, this yeah, it's it's substantially different. 
Now, is there a flag point up here? There is. We're just trying to, I guess, flank it in a way. Oh, that's... All right. Let's do this, boys. There we go. One guy down. Storm it, boys. Take it. They're counterattacking. Oh, yeah. Look at this. We've captured the village. We've pretty much... Wait, are they back? They just back capped us. Okay. All right, let's actually change the battle plan. We need to defend this with our lives and from here push in. So hopefully our, our teammates... Oh my God. We've actually got a, only a few troops left. This doesn't look like it's going to end very well for the attackers. All right, where's this guy at? Come on, boys. I need, I need your assistance. Oh. <laughs> All right, this isn't looking good. Maybe we gave the defenders too many guys and we don't have too many. But needless to say, man, do we, we need a proper little dock area, I think, for our little boats. Our attack craft. Look at this. The, like, So this is like the Zodiac, right? And it got updated a while ago. You can only imagine how awesome the new attack helicopter will probably be. But you know what? This is the new Ravenfield update. We landed on aircraft carrier. We showed off the new map. Let me know if you guys want to see more Ravenfield. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. I'm going to go fishing.